Today I'm heading out on the trail to Eagle Falls and Eagle Lake. Why don't you come join me? Eagle Falls is actually made up of two separate falls. The upper, which is over 40 feet, and the lower measures in at almost 80. Just past the viewpoint, you can take the stairs to get an up-close view of the lower falls. Shortly after you start on this trail, you'll be able to hear the falls in the distance. At less than a fourth of a mile, you'll see the bridge going directly over the waterfalls. At just a quarter mile into this hike, you'll come upon stone stairs that have been cut into the rock wall. We're just about to cross the bridge here at Eagle Falls, and if you're up for just a little bit of a hike, this is one of the most accessible waterfalls in Lake Tahoe. Once you make it to the falls, you can see the small pool above, and if you pass the bridge, you're on your way to Eagle Lake if you want to continue your journey. In the summer and fall, the pool above the falls is a popular area to swim and wade, but you want to be careful because in the spring with the raging of water, this would not be a safe place to play. The Eagle Falls Trail offers some of the most beautiful landscape views of the Lake Tahoe Basin, from the granite peaks to the lush vegetation and lots of evergreens. Make sure to take some time to explore the giant granite boulders while you're here on the Eagle Falls Trail. Once you pass the falls, you're in for an upward hike to the lake, but a fair portion is shaded, so even on a sunny day, it's a fun hike. Even though the hike to the falls is super simple, don't be deceived into thinking the rest of the trail to the lake is too. With over a 400 foot elevation gain, a couple of miles can really get your heart rate out. This is a great fun trail in Tahoe, but you want to watch for the weather because it would be dangerous to be working through all this granite when it's wet and slippery.
be left in awe once you reach Eagle Lake, which is located inside the 63,000 acre federally protected desolation wilderness. Many people stop and turn around at the falls. And if you're short on time, it's a wonderful place to go. But most people think of Lake Tahoe when they visit Tahoe. And this is an incredible little gem I would want to miss out on on my visit to Tahoe. If you fancy an ice cold dip in the water, you can actually swim out to the lake's little island which is beautiful when the sun starts cascading down on it. Whether you're just up for the quick hike to Eagle Falls, or you have a little more time and energy to hike to Eagle Lake, this is a wonderful place to enjoy the beauty of Tahoe. Thanks for joining me today here at Eagle Falls. For more information, see my blog post at flyingdawnmarie.com. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Until next week, I hope you find adventure and encouragement wherever you go. Bye.